Welcome to the public meeting for the Layaway Road Planning and Environmental Linkages Study. This study was conducted by the Chicago Metropolitan Agency for Planning, or CMAP, on behalf of the City of Joliet. The study was coordinated with the Illinois Department of Transportation and the Federal Highway Administration. Please watch this introductory video about the project. The Chicago Metropolitan Agency for Planning, CMAP, is undertaking a study of Laraway Road from Illinois Route 53 to Brandon Road in Will County, Illinois. The study is focused on the at-grade or level crossing of Laraway Road at the Union Pacific Railroad. In 2019, Laraway Road was one of 47 at-grade railroad crossings prioritized for further study or improvement by CMAP and its partner agencies. A few facts. In 2019, CMAP counted 22 trains over a full day, consisting of 10 Amtrak trains, 6 freight trains, and 6 trains switching over the crossing. Counting false activations, the gates were lowered 25 times during the day. On Laraway Road, IDOT recently estimated traffic volumes at 10,700 vehicles daily. In 2018, CMAP counted 8,700 vehicles, about three-fourths of which were trucks. Indeed, this section of Laraway Road is in an industrial area that generates many truck trips. The speed limit on Laraway Road is 40 miles an hour, but substantial delay is a big concern at the crossing, particularly for truckers who are trying to meet delivery deadlines. During our observations, Amtrak trains block the crossing for only a minute each, but freight trains block the crossing an average of nine minutes each, with a maximum blockage of almost 17 minutes. Such long gate blockages cause extensive queues of trucks to form on Laraway. Just four trucks carrying 53-foot trailers can extend the length of a football field. Westbound blockages routinely extend back a half mile through the intersection with Route 53, while eastbound blockages routinely extend to Brandon Road. When the gates rise, eastbound queues platoon to the Route 53 intersection, but the limited green time for left-turning trucks causes the queues to break up only slowly. Queues resulting from the gate blockages, but also from truck traffic volumes exceeding capacity, frequently back up from the Route 53 intersection onto the railroad tracks, as seen here. U.S. and Illinois law prohibit trucks from entering a railroad crossing unless the truck has sufficient room on the other side of the crossing to completely clear the crossing, but trucks have frequently been seen on the crossing blocking it, as shown on the video. Adding to the delay, some vehicles are required to turn on flashers and stop at most at-grade crossings. At Laraway Road, these vehicles include a few school buses and transit vehicles, but are mostly trucks carrying hazardous materials. Many of the trucks carrying hazardous materials are tanker trucks, but also include containers, stake beds carrying gases, and semi-trailers. CMAP counted 73 safety stops at the crossing over 24 hours, but as you might see at a stop sign, only about half of the vehicles came to a complete stop, and four of those stopping did not stop at the stop bar. The crossing gates frequently require repairs, often because of trucks striking the gates. Over the past six years, the gates have required an average of 44 repairs per year, with 20 per year indicating that there was a gate hit, broke, or knocked by a vehicle. The time required to repair the gates has been about one hour 45 minutes for the past two years, but was substantially higher in previous years. The crossing must often be closed for such repairs. All of this has substantial costs, including vehicle delay, reduced reliability for truck drivers, police response, and the actual cost of the gate repairs. CMAP's study is employing the Federal Planning and Environmental Linkages, or PEL, process to develop a draft purpose and need, identification and evaluation of alternatives, one or more alternatives to be carried forward for further analysis, and a planning level cost estimate of the alternatives to be carried forward. This segment of Laraway Road is under the jurisdiction of the City of Joliet. While the City of Joliet has not committed to proceeding with additional engineering or construction for Laraway Road, the study will help the City determine the need, scope, and cost of a potential improvement, thus assisting the City 
in the decision-making process. For more information about this study, see engage.cmap.illinois.gov. Thank you. Thank you for reviewing these materials. We encourage you to visit the stations to learn more about how the project has developed and what alternatives are being recommended for further consideration. Please provide your feedback. You can submit comments online by visiting the project website or by emailing the CMAP contacts provided. You also can fill out and mail the comment form included in the project brochure. The brochure contains project information and a summary of the alternatives recommended for further consideration. Comments received or postmarked by April 30th will become part of the official project summary. CMAP also will host a live Zoom meeting about the Railway Road Pell study on April 14, 2021 at 6 p.m. You will also be able to chat with the project team and ask questions. Registration for the public meeting is available on our project site at engage.cmap.illinois.gov forward slash railway road at Union Pacific Railroad Crossing. Thank you.